accommodation for two dogs and two cats. Um, it says it's a spray gel, and when they say it's a gel, they really mean it. It's not like a mist. It's not really much of a spray. It looks like that. I don't know if you can see that, but... Yeah. It's not a water. It's kind of jelly-like. Um, in winter, my hair gets really dry, and it begins to get fizzy. So, this is the first time it ever happened to me, and of course I know right away stats and stuff, so actually use these kind of products. And um, I will be doing another video about how to get rid of my frizzy hair, but this is one of the products that I use. Um, it doesn't keep my hair not frizzy all day, but it does help, especially in the morning, because when I brush my hair, finish blow drying it and it, um, it's frizzy. Like, um, yeah. Especially where my long hair is. It, I can start hearing that popping static noise. And then all I have to do to do that is I get that gel, rub it in my hands, run my fingers through my hair, and what I like about this is that you don't need to use much, and it smells very good, like, it smells good. Now, um, yeah, I just put it all over my hair. My hair where it gets frizzy the most is on the sides right here. My long hair. Um, and that's pretty much about it. But, um, yeah. This says really helps a lot. Um, it says it leaves hair up to two point five less frizzy after just one use. Um, the frizz defense complex allows it to lock in a smooth frizz free look that your hair can remember to maintain for up to five washings. Fighting frizz now. That's what it says in my hair. But, um, yeah. That's what it says. So, I don't know how much you can get these at Walmart or anything, but I got mine at Liquidation World. Mm -hmm. My hair bought it because they're really cheap, and, yeah. And so, my next video will be about how I control my frizzy hair. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or concerns, tell me about me or yeah, or I'll leave a comment below down there. And um, I'll see you guys soon. Oh, okay. happy holidays. Um, for all those people out there who don't have as much, you guys should be helpful and donate as much as you can volunteer. Actually, this Friday, I volunteer to um, be one of those people who ring bells to get donations for Salvation Army. I'll be doing that with my friends. I'm actually really excited to do it because I will be giving my free time to people who need all this money. And so, maybe this Christmas you guys could pick a present out of big pile of presents and maybe drop it off at the Salvation Army Army or um give it to someone who's less fortunate than you because today in school I go to a Catholic school the principal always has me do announcements in the morning and he said if you have one or two more jackets give the other to Yeah, it shouldn't be much of a sacrifice, like, my hoodie right here, like, I have a few of them, and of 
course, I do need them because I wear something every day, but I will be willing to give up a hoodie, but in, <laughs> I like hoodies. So instead of giving the one up, I'm going to be volunteering for the Salvation Army kind of thing. And I hope you guys do the same. So, um, oh yeah, and keep the new town uh, elementary school in our hearts because on Friday, there was a shooting there, and we just want to keep those people who were lost in our hearts and, and pray for them, and um, it's actually very sad because they were killed around Christmas time, and it's really sad, and so I hope you guys keep them in your hearts, and I hope you guys pray. Um, if you're not Catholic or anything, then maybe you can just keep them in your hearts don't forget them because they were just kids and young adults. So I hope you guys have an awesome holiday. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you next time. Bye!